Right, welcome back to another quick Wainwright walk and today we finish off the Eastern Fells. It's a bit of a punishment walk. The other day I was supposed to add seat sandals, which is where we're going, onto my Grisdale Horseshoe Loop, but it was going to be too much and I would have been struggling to get back down before dark. So I, this is a Route 1 route. We've just parked at the free parking on top of Dunmill Rays there. I'm going to be going up this gill here. Cut sharply right at the top of it, just, be, just before you get to Grisdale Town. The head steeply, and it looks like boggily, <laughs> up onto Seat Sandal. Cup of tea waiting for me. It's a Sunday afternoon. Got out of bed pretty late this morning, but thankfully it's pretty quiet because it's dreary, miserable, and there's a lot of wind as well. So, uh, let's get up here finish these eastern fells off. Let's go. Hey, you couldn't see it coming. You might have thought it, but you couldn't change it. Hey, it's not right or wrong. It's about trying Find the silver lining Rain and fire Highs and lows, you name it Cold and warmth Laughs and cries, you have it The world goes by And by the time it does you miss climb that's been oh it's been like Ben seat sandal and nevis today the coming up the gills fine you might have seen it in the video there but that path from grassdale town straight up oh my god it's probably one of the steepest i've ever done and it's muddy as well i reckon they could do with a gravel drop on that path because it's eroding quite badly anyway 
Ah, this is a, a beautiful fell. I might flash up a little bit of footage so you can see what it's like on a nice day. I've been doing that recently, often, and it's, uh, yeah, it just gives you an idea what it's like up here. I've been up here before, so, yeah, I'm not bothered about the views today. It's starting to spit with a little bit of snow. Like I say, I'm done with bloody snow. I've had enough of it this winter. Oh, and wind. Anyway, cheer myself up with a cup of tea. Aye, so, seat sandal, hmm, nice little table here for my cup, that's what the problem is with mountains, there's a lack of flat rocks on the top so you can put your tea on, um, and I do like arse shaped rocks as I've said on a previous video before and this is quite quite comfortable here, uh, out of the wind at all, oh I, I don't know what to say about this one, <laughs> I'm sorry I have to bring you this short video, like I say I don't like doing them but I couldn't do this on the Grisdale Horseshoe Walk. If I thinking back now, if I came up here up that path on that walk, oh my god, no chance I would have got home before sunset. And uh, yeah, Sun Sunday Crag just beat the hell out of me that day. I don't think I've been as terrified as I was up there. Um, I've been in conditions like that before, but when there's nobody else around, and I didn't see anybody after Grisdale Town on that walk. You just think, mm, should I be here? But uh, nah, it's done now. Eastern Fells complete. Three more walks. We've got uh, the Southern Fells still to do. Um, far Western Fells and oh, I Far Eastern Fells. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'm gonna delay them a little bit because I want some clear weather. I'm done with snow, like I say, and I'm doing score fell quite soon. So. I don't fancy mucking about in the snow and that, especially going up Fox's Gully and things like that. I've never done that before, so I'd, I'd like to uh, have a amble, ramble on that, uh, on that without any issues. So, oh, all right. So, what can I say about this walk? Can it give you some content for this short video? It's a great start, I feel. I would say. I've always said, if you want to start winning, right, start on Dodd in the northern fells beautiful parking there's a cafe at the bottom bring your nan bring your dog everybody can go beautiful path all the way around and that'll get you started in um, experiencing what it's like to ascend 500 meters this one however i would say this is two or three steps above dodd in the fact that the path isn't beautiful all the way if you came and did this one this would be your first kind of experience of exposed rock and um, minor scrambling where you have to put your hand on and just, just be careful where you put your foot in coming up that gill there because uh, some of them can be quite slippy um, it also gives you an experience of coming straight up a, a grass path which they are very slippy um, they, they shouldn't be underestimated I prefer walking on rock all day to to those paths there <laughs> I might be contradicting myself there, but there are some hills that are nice that are nice and grassy. But uh, yeah, I'd use this as maybe a, a step up from Dodd. Do Dodd, do maybe the Mel Fells. Mel Fells is kind of grassy. And then do this one as like, oh, maybe I can go up to 700 odd meters. Uh, go on a bit of rock, bit of grass, bit of, bit of ascent. See how I feel after that. It's taken me an hour and a half to get up here. Uh, oh. Uh, it's no, it's no mean feat. It's not an easy hill for its uh, relative short size. Anyway, I'm gonna finish my brew here without spilling it all over my fucking jacket and get cracking on back down. <laughs> Let's go. Right, I've hung fire here for about 20 minutes. It hasn't cleared up, sadly. I think the clags rested at about 650 meters, so this one's just in it i think but anyway we've had our brew we're saddled up let's crack it on doing this hill let's go right that's just just down from the clag of seat sandal you can see grisdale tarn now where we walked yon end of it last uh well, two days ago 
Anyway, oh my God, it's absolutely freezing up here. I wouldn't be surprised if there's another big dumping of snow before March is out, you know. Sadly, I think we're gonna to have to wait a little longer for spring. Oh God, this is my hands, I forgot my gloves today. I didn't think I'd need them. Thought the snow was on its way to being melted. <laughs> but uh, anyway, just down here to the bottom and then the nice path down the gill to the car. Right, so that's just back out of the wind and safely into the gill now. I just thought I'd better wrap up the adventure from here. One win right today, seat sandal. 700 odd meters, I believe. I might be slightly wrong about that. But anyway, it's been a great adventure. Oh, a little bit of a scramble there. <laughs> Probably should have picked a better time to film this outro. So I just want to say, take care of yourselves and I'll see you back out on the fells very, very soon. Peace.